फ्री ट्रेड एग्रीमेंट India stands for a transparent, equitable, inclusive, predictable, non-discriminatory and rules-based international trading system. In this context, India's free trade agreements, FTAs and preferential trade agreements, PTAs, may be seen as a measured and calibrated exposure of the Indian economy to international competition. Here, Niryat Bhandu will explain to Nikhu some details about FTAs. What are FTAs? FTAs establish a fair set of rules for trade between the agreeing countries. They provide each other favorable treatment by reducing trade barriers. Firstly, they cut down the duties on import of goods to and from the agreeing countries. Besides, they also work on easing out non-tariff barriers to exports like easing quantitative import restrictions, easing customs procedures improving market access for service exports and better investment rules why do countries sign ftas ftas help in trade creation job creation and economic growth they are also a diplomatic tool for improving international relations how does it affect indian exporters and importers if India has an FTA with the trading country and if the goods being traded is covered by the tariff reductions under the FTA, then the importer or exporter has to pay a reduced import duty and not the standard duty that is applied to other countries. Here is an example. The Asian countries impose an import duty of 20% on leather goods. However, under India-Asian FTA, the duty for India is 0%. This means that an Indian leather exporter like Niku can sell its goods to Asian countries at a 20% price advantage. What are the different nomenclatures for FTAs? FTA arrangements are known by various nomenclatures such as Preferential Trade Agreement PTA, Free Trade Agreement FTA, Regional Trade Agreement RTA, Comprehensive Economic Cooperation Agreement CECA, Comprehensive Economic Partnership Agreement CEPA and Broad Based Trade and Investment Agreement BTIA. The difference amongst them is in their coverage. CECA, CEPA, BTIA cover an integrated package of agreements on goods, services, investments and intellectual properties etc. while the more traditional FTAs are limited to trade in goods only. Which are the countries with which India has a free trade agreement? As of 2017, India has signed 10 FTAs and 6 limited preferential trade agreements, that is PTAs. The lists of the FTAs that have been signed by India are India-Sri Lanka FTA, SAFTA, Agreement on South Asian Free Trade Area, the seven member countries are India, Pakistan, Sri Lanka, Bangladesh, Nepal, Bhutan and Maldives. India-Nepal Treaty of Trade India-Bhutan Agreement on Trade, Commerce and Transit India-Thailand FTA Early Harvest Scheme that is EHS India-Singapore CECA India-Asian FTA Asian countries include 10 of the Southeast Asian countries that is Vietnam, Thailand, Singapore, Cambodia, Indonesia, Malaysia, Myanmar, Philippines, Laos and Brunei. India-South Korea CEPA, India-Japan CEPA, India-Malaysia CECA. The list of preferential trade agreements that is PTAs signed by India are APTA that is Asia-Pacific Trade Agreement. Member states exchanging concessions are India, China, South Korea, Sri Lanka and Bangladesh. GSTP, Global System of Trade Preferences under WTO. This is open to all the member countries under the Group of 77 under the WTO. India-Afghanistan PTA, india Mercosur PTA, India-Chile PTA, and SAPTA SARC Preferential Trading Agreement and SATIS SARC Agreement on Trade in Services. What documents are required to avail duty concession under any of India's FTAs? 
to take the advantage of tariff benefits given under an FTA, the Indian exporter like Niku has to prove that her goods are made in India as per the rules of origin agreed under the given FTA. This is proven by a document called the Preferential Certificate of Origin. The lists of agencies in India Niku can approach for such a certificate of origin is listed under Appendix 2B of the Foreign Trade Policy. However, in case of an Indian importer, the certificate of origin would be issued by the corresponding agencies in the seller's country. You may see the video on certificates of origin for more details. For more information on FTAs, please visit the Department of Commerce website.